Hello, it's Jason Payne from Cold Banker Dean Hop Realtors. Well, once again, I'm back at the beautiful one acre community of Vintage Oaks. And I'm not actually out for Vintage Oaks. I'm out of promoting the new community called the Preserves, which can be right next door to Vintage Oaks off of 2722. All those homes on those one acre lots are gonna be built by Grand Endeavor, and this is their model home. So the best way to get to their Grand Endeavor model home for the Preserves is come into Vintage Oaks right off 2722 and then take your first right and then you'll see this model home. It's been about two and a half years since I did the model home tour of this house. So yeah, let's go do another video tour of this home built by Grand Endeavor. I really love the location of this uh, community and the preserves. Uh, just talked to the owner again, Mr. Jimmy Jacobs. He's out putting out signs. I love the fact that the owner's out there doing those things. Um, the location for this community for the preserves like I said it's right off 2722 just before you get to the back entrance of Vintage Oaks here uh, but it gives you really good proximity to both uh, Canyon Lake to the north New Braunfels to the south um, the grocery store HEB is still just an eight minute drive from here tax rates are still going to be the same as Vintage Oaks looking somewhere between uh right around 1.8 percent so low taxes gorgeous lots and i'm going to show you those lots in a different video but i wanted to recap show you a little bit more about what grand endeavor does i love them as a builder they do mostly semi-custom homes but they can do custom homes uh so they've got i think 12 plans that they choose from and then you can tweak it all right, let's head on inside and check out this model home. Now, Grand Endeavor Homes, they have plans that can be anywhere between just over 2,400 square feet all the way up to just over 3,800 square feet. This, what we're seeing here, is a sweet leaf. It is just over 3,700 square feet. And, uh, yeah, it is a beautiful home. Right when you come in, you have the office, and I love the fact that they have uh, tall ceilings in here. And um, <clears throat> I always tell people if they're considering buying, uh, getting the extra height in the ceilings isn't that expensive, but man, is it worth it because the house just looks so much grander when you go with the tall ceilings. All right. Let's explore the sweet leaf a little bit. You've got the main dining room section right here, up front. With a little butler's kitchen area here. And uh, yep, they went with the green counter cabinets, which I actually, they grow on you. I'll admit it wouldn't have been my first choice, but they definitely grow on you. And they've got the little uh, sink there, but man. Let's look at this kitchen here. Go back in the main space. And you see just how awesome this plan is. I really like it. I've got buyers building both a cottonwood and a Jolie plan. But this is the sweet leaf. Big, beautiful island. Nice single basin sink. And I really like Grand Endeavor's plan of, like I was talking about before, they got their base plans and then you start tweaking them. My client that's getting a Jolie built he added extra two feet to the main living area. Grand Endeavor can do that. Um, another one that's getting a cottonwood plan being built. They have the uh, option for the giant closet. I've been doing some videos on that. So yeah, hopefully you saw those. A beautiful kitchen. Um, both Vintage Oaks and the Preserves gonna be gas communities. So that's always nice. Your breakfast nook area. And I definitely love, I can't stop talking about how much I love this location. Beautiful oak trees, lots of deer. I wanna showcase off what's back here. Um, you always can have the option to have this whole sliding wall door. And surprisingly, Grand Endeavor's less expensive than some of the other production home builders when you start adding up the upgrades. I was like, man, they could do that door cheaper than some of the other production homes. All right, the Sweet Leaf has this neat little game room area. 
that uh, definitely can be like kid zone. Could you try again? No, Siri, leave me alone, I'm videoing. All right, so you've got eight foot doors throughout on this. Let's check out the closets. Oh, good size closets. And the last time I videoed this house, I mentioned what cost per square foot they're building. And yeah, that I shouldn't have said that because that was almost three years ago. Definitely things have changed since then. What I can tell you is compared to other custom home builders, you're going to get an amazing bang for the buck uh, build going over Grand Endeavor. And they're an established company that's been around for a very long time. So they're not going away. Uh, just met the owner, uh, Mr. Jimmy Jacobs. He was out actually putting up signs in the preserve section. Um, when you're going on a path like this, it's really nice to have an owner that's going to be involved. And he's definitely involved. It's very rare do you see an owner out putting up signs in the community. So... That's a good sign from a realtor standpoint. I love seeing that versus a builder that's out traveling the world going going to different conferences all the time. Going, yeah, I'm a home builder, but other people are actually doing the work. But no, Jimmy Jacobs is actually out there involved with the process, which I like to see. All right. Oh, let's go back this way. I want to save the master bedroom for the end so I saw this but I want to show off the laundry room really good size laundry room got your little mud room and a little tucked away bedroom back here perfect for long-term guest or if you've got that kiddo that you just can't get out of the house they can live back here or if you're deciding hey we're gonna go with a big house but we need a place for my mother-in-law to be at this is really ideal for them because they can have their own full bath really have to give them their own privacy sorry there's the dreaded toilet seat up i didn't check beforehand but beautifully done. And like I said, definitely it's nice having everybody kind of out on the wing. This is the one of the closets, but Grand Endeavor is using that as their office, not closets, their garage, but Grand Endeavor is using it at their office. So no point going in there showcasing, looking at that. But yeah, now let's go ahead into the master bedroom. Love the insets. Well, before going there, let's go check out the back patio. Sorry, right, making this video a little long, wasting some time going back and forth. Here we go. But talking about the community, 2722 is kind of right there. So this particular house has a little road noise but most of the houses in the community do not and that's including the preserves but we're kind of right close to the highway here you are going to have septic out in this area but i mean i just love this part of the texas hill country it is beautiful as i'm filming this it is december 15th 2022 weather outside uh partly cloudy but a lot of sun and what I'm showing, 59 degrees, absolutely gorgeous day today. So if you're coming from an environment where it's, that door is locked, uh, really cold and worried about how cold it is in Texas, most of the time this is kind of it. Uh, we do have our spells where it gets a little warmer and sometimes we have our spells where it gets a little colder. But no long term. Usually it's cold for like four days. All right, now we're finally coming into the master bedroom. Check out this bathroom. Wow, they've definitely thrown every bell and whistle at this because it is a model home. I didn't disclose that at the beginning like I normally do. 
but check out this shower. Wow, that is a big, beautiful shower. Love the floating vanity, which they got the green in here again. And this is a good size master closet. Lots of hanging space. Beautiful soaking tub. And I love the little texture tile they have on the wall. Water closet. And then the rest of the master bedroom area. Well, the door going out to the patio. Nice tray ceilings. Just beautifully done. And I love the uh, almost smooth texture they have on the walls here too. Like I said, this is the sweet leaf plan, just over 2,700 square feet. Uh, beautiful home. And uh, yeah, at the end of this, I'm gonna do a picture of the different plans. Well, actually, let's, before I wrap it up, let me go show you those plans. All right, we're now back in their office area. So you can see you've got the hickory here. That's just over 2,400 square feet. And I'm gonna give you a quick little glance at all the little plans. So you can pause the video and kind of see what really jumps out at you and what might fit your needs. So lots of plans to choose from. Let's see, there's the Joe Lee. I do know they're gonna be building an inventory home in the preserves of the Joe Lee. They're talking about letting me list it, so that'd be kind of cool. But uh, yeah, that's I've got a client getting a Jolie built right now. And let's swing on back down here. Yeah, beautiful plan, the Magnolia. And I've got another plan building this cottonwood plan with a big closet. And I got information that they are going to be building this as a spec home in the preserve section as well. Cypress. And now we're getting some bigger homes, 3,600 square feet. The Willow. And this is the home we're in right now, the Sweet Leaf. And then the biggest they have is the Walnut, which is a two-story home. All right. All right, that's gonna do it for this model home tour for Grand Endeavor. Remember, this is a sweet leaf plan. And if you're interested in getting a house built by Grand Endeavor in the preserves, you have to come to Vintage Oaks, which is just down this, just next door to the preserves. This is the model home you would come to. And you talk to Javier or Trevor, they'd be more than helpful and, uh, tons of information. Hopefully I've provided you plenty of information in this video. If I did, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. I love helping people relocate from all over the world to the beautiful Texas Hill Country. I, I'm a local realtor and I do these videos to help you guys and to help build my business. All right, talk to you soon. And uh, the next video will be a driving tour of the preserves near Vintage Oaks. All right, talk to you soon, bye.